voting on Speaker Pelosi's $1 trillion Washington takeover of health care. This bill bulldozes individual liberty and puts the government just where it doesn't belong, right smack dab in the middle of your personal health care decisions. This bill forces every single person in this country to produce or purchase government-approved health care or go to jail. Businesses must also offer government-approved health care or face hundreds of billions of dollars in job-killing taxes. Unfortunately, government-approved health care will be defined by a handful of bureaucrats around a conference table in Washington. This unprecedented Washington power grab eliminates an individual's right to choose what kind of health care is best for them and their families. Speaker Pelosi's 20-pound, 2,000-page bill costs $2.2 million per word. The American public has made their voices heard. They're sick and tired of the government sticking its nose where it doesn't belong. They're fed up with Washington's trillion-dollar bailout, free handouts, and special interest paybacks. The Democrats in Congress need to listen and come up with a bipartisan patient-centered plan. We can do better with a targeted, fiscally responsible approach that makes health insurance more affordable, more accessible, and available. Real health reform protects the patient's right to choose their own care. Real health reform gives doctors the freedom to do what's best for their patients. We can do all this without piling trillions of dollars in debt onto our children and our grandchildren. Vote down this deficit, ballooning, job-killing Washington takeover of health care today. Yield back.